friends, if you haven't watched my previous video on how to make pom-poms and all the different ways, I recommend watching that first because that shows you how to make these. I made this one with 200 loops and this one with 100 loops. We're going to put them together. Put just enough hot glue in the middle of the bottom one, white, for the yellow one to stick on. Put it on quickly before it dries. You can press it to press it together. Now it's time to shape it into an egg. We're gonna take our plate and start shaping it into the best shape we can get that looks like an egg. After we're done, it will eventually look like this. You can cut off any stray hairs. To begin its face. We'll start with the nose. It's in the middle so it'll give us a good scale of where everything goes. We'll start by wrapping some yarn around like this. going to take this piece of yarn, put your index and thumb finger like this, and wrap it around, and tie it to this string. Then, cut it right over here. We'll take some yellow yarn. Some around like this. Then cut it off. at the end. You want to make sure there's only a little bit of space so it's easy to glue it on. Make sure there's a second knot. and cut off the tops. When you're done, you may want to trim it so they're all the same size. Now it's time for the arms. Again, we'll be using yellow arm yarn. First, cut a little piece of yarn to put on top of your finger, so it'll be easier to tie. Then, wrap the yarn around your finger five times. Cut the yarn, and then tie it. Then remove the yarn from your finger, tighten it, and then 
and tie again. Now cut the yarn. first one. Now we have to make a second one. Simply repeat the process. For the eyes, you can use some black beads. Now it's time to start gluing everything on. We'll start with the hair. It's easiest because it's on top. We'll take a glue gun. First, we'll do the hair. It's easiest because it's right on top. We'll make a little hole with our fingers on top and insert some hot glue inside. Just enough to hold it in place. Then put inside the flaps and close it up. If you need some more hot glue to keep it in place, you can add some. There we have the hair. We can trim it a little. About that high. That should be good. Isn't that cute? Now, time for the nose. We'll put it right there in the middle. And I'm just trimming a little off so it's easier to glue it on. We'll put a tiny dot of glue right in the middle, right after digging a small hole. Insert the nose into the hole. It's time for the flaps. The flaps are going to go on either side, just like this. First, we're going to dig a little hole again, insert some glue. And do the same thing. Now we'll do the same on the other side. Then we'll put some hot glue on the other side and attach the other flap. I'm making sure not to make them too big or else the beads will go inside. Put some hot glue and stick on the bead. Now I'll do the same on the other side. Put some hot glue and stick on the bead. I hope you had a lot of fun making this pom-pom chick with me, and I hope it turned out really well for you too. Thanks for watching. Bye!